My friend's name is Jesus. Who is Jesus? Are you like him? Is he your American idol? Or your Chinese idol? Jesus is salvation. Jesus is eternal life. Jesus teaches by his life. Jesus ministers by his life. Jesus teaches us how to be faithful. Jesus is the Messiah. Jesus is the King. Jesus does miracles. He raised people from the dead. He healed all the diseases. He multiplied food. He told stories, parables. He taught people how to praise God like a little child. He was friends with sinners. People that didn't always measure up. He moved mountains. He preached. He brought the kingdom. He counseled people with wisdom and knowledge from God. He lived God's word. He spoke to storms. He forgave everyone. He restored everyone. He was a servant. He corrected. He instructed. He evangelized. He brought the kingdom. He forgave. He lived life. He lived God's word. He prophesied. He reverenced his father, God. He lived in the power of God. He believed all things were possible. He knew the beginning from the end. He never doubted. He taught us how to trust his father. He walked on water. He lived in compassion for everyone. He went away to a quiet place to spend time with his daddy. He loved his father God. Not tradition. Not religion. He taught wisdom. He brought heaven to earth. He was no respecter of persons. He treated everybody the same. That's documented in Matthew. Mark, Luke and John. Isaiah, the Old Testament before it came. You can check it out.
It's you know, a great book to read. It changes lives. My purpose today is to talk to you about Jesus. Can we be like him? Can we know him? Can we live as he lived? Can we do the things he did? I'm going to have Philip read Isaiah 61. Ivy's going to read it for us. Zhiyewawatling 使他們稱為公義樹之耶和華所栽的叫他得榮耀你們必吃用列國的財物他們在後裔必在列國中被人認識田地怎樣使所種的發生主耶和華必照樣使公義和讚美在萬民中發出主耶和華必照樣使公義和讚美在萬民中發出 going to read it in English The Spirit of the Sovereign Lord is on me because the Lord has anointed me to preach good news to the poor. He has sent me to bind up the brokenhearted, to, pro to proclaim freedom for the captives and release from darkness for the prisoners, to proclaim the year of the Lord's favor and the day of vengeance of our Lord, to comfort all who mourn and provide for those who grieve in Zion, to bestow on them a crown of beauty instead of ashes, the oil of gladness instead of mourning, and a garment of praise instead of the spirit of despair, to be called oaks of righteousness, a planting of the Lord for the display of his splendor. They will rebu rebuild the ancient cities and restore the places long devastated. They will, ne they will renew the ruined cities and have that have been devastated for generations. Aliens will uh, shepherd your flock, foreigners will work your fields and vineyards, and you will be called priests of the Lord. You will be named ministers of our God. You will be fed on the wealth of nations, and in the riches you will, be, you will boast. Instead of the shame, my people will receive a double portion, and instead of disgrace, you will rejoice in their inheritance and so they will inherit a double portion in their land and everlasting joy will be theirs for I the Lord love justice I hate robbery and inequities 
in equity. In my faithfulness, I will reward them and make an everlasting covenant with them. Their descendants will be known among the nations and their offsprings among the people. All will see that we will acknowledge that they are a people the Lord has blessed. I delight greatly in the Lord. My soul rejoices in my God, for He has clothed me with a garment of salvation and arrayed me in the robe of righteousness as a bridegroom adorns his head like a priest and as a bride adorns herself with her jewels. For as the soil makes the sprout come up and a garden causes seeds to grow, so the so sovereign lo Lord will make righteousness and praise spring up before all nations. Amen. You know, a lot of people um, think the prophetic is kind of out there, but Jesus was prophesying right here in Isaiah 61. This was his. Jesus actually prophesied. This is his first public appearance. Just like our little cards that we put out in the street. Jesus made a public announcement. His public announcement was that he was the Messiah. Did he say he was God? Did he say he was the Son of God? Did he say he was Jesus? He did. He was. He is. He always will be. The second thing that Jesus made in the, this announcement, it was in Nazareth. In a synagogue. He announced two comings of Christ. One for salvation. And two for judgment. In Isaiah 61, it is beginning to tell us who Jesus is. One to three talks about God was bringing good news to the people. Everybody, every Jewish person on the face of the earth. And he had a message in that synagogue when he made his public announcement. He was there to preach to people that were meek and lowly. He was there to, to um, bind up the broken hearted. That means that he wanted to touch broken hearts. He wanted to give liberty. You can be in a prison, but not be in jail. And Jesus said, come to me. He was there to proclaim the year of the Lord. And the day of the vengeance of God. But he was also there to comfort people. He wanted to turn their mourning when they were really sad. He wanted to take oil of joy and go 
He wanted us to know his joy. 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 He talks about bringing life. He talks about taking the old places that were like ancient ruins and putting up a five story hotel. He talks about generations of people from my generation to your generation. That we didn't do so well in my generation. Down to your generation. Some of your generation isn't doing too well. But God. Is here to change that. Change that. He talks about um, people are going to work for you. You're going to sit in the gates of the elders. You are a privileged people. You're not the worst. You're the best. He says every single person will be restored. Will be blessed. Will prosper. Now in Isaiah 7, he looks at us. And he says, I'm going to take away your shame. I have a question. Just, just wait. Was that 617 or Isaiah 617. Isaiah 61, okay. He says, I will give you a double portion for your shame. Does that mean we get a double portion of shame? No. He says, I take your shame off. And I take your disgrace off. And you can rejoice. In your inheritance in him. Guess what? Your land is called Ahabsabah. Uh, that is a term for Israel's land. And Beulah. In Blessing or blessed land of God. That's you. That's me. He um in eight and nine, he says, um, don't bother to worship me. If you oppress your fellow man, Look at that dirty drug addict. Look at that 
awful woman of the streets. Look at the beggars. Why aren't they working? Jesus made a deal with us. In 8-9. He said, I love justice. He says, I want you to help everybody. He said, I hate robbery. He said, I, I don't like to be in the presence of sin. But this is the deal. I am faithful to reward and make an everlasting covenant with you and your descendants that you'll be known among all the nations. You know, Isaiah 61.10, he says, As we delight greatly in my soul, and as we rejoice in God, we become his bride. Husband and wife. Have you ever thought about getting married? Have you ever gotten married? My wedding was fantabulous. Party dresses. Worshippers. Salvation message. Musicians. Flowers. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful ladies. Hold up, And my handsome, handsome groom. <laughs> the best. All suited. Marching down the aisle. People playing instruments. People dancing. Beautiful jewels. A bride, a wedding. Every girl's heart throb. Every man, oh, so excited. And the groom. He has his robe of righteousness on. He's like our high priest. Our pastor. It's so wonderful. Jesus has the biggest joy for his people. Uh, Jesus has made us like a big garden. He's plowed the garden. Like Ivy was doing this morning. 
間種咁樣。Planting the seeds in the garden。一粒一粒誒、呃、種子係係係咁樣種喺個佢依個花園，我哋嘅我哋依個主嘅花園。Watering the garden。啊，落水。With righteousness。用精。突然間，嗰啲芽，個收割就慢慢來啦，個芽就長，長成。And we go to the party with all the food that we bring。然後我哋就一齊一齊帶住我哋嘅食物去呢個 party， 呢個聚會。I want to read to you。我想啊，俾你讀。Out of Matthew, Matthew 19, Matthew 19, verse 24. Bye bye. Yes, so I may. And he answered unto them, He have not read. 19:4. 十九章四 ，nineteen fourteen，I'm sorry。十九章十四章，十九章第四節，唔係啊，十四章。He said, "Did Jesus say, 'Let the little children and forbid them not to come unto me, for such is the kingdom of heaven.' Jesus calls us little children." 十九啊，马太福音十九章十四节。耶稣说：让小孩子到我这里来，不要禁止他们，因为在天国的正是这样的人。系咪继续啊？ And Jesus says that we're His restoration. 耶稣说：我我哋就系。He talks about in Jeremiah 30 that we are the restoration of His glory. So raise your hand and tell me one thing that you could do to be like Jesus. You could weep like Jesus. What else? 可可以好似啊耶穌為我哋悲哀，為我哋哭。有冇第啲咧 ？Could you dance like Jesus? 你可唔可以啊啊跳舞好，即系啊開心到跳舞好似啊耶穌一樣啦 ？Could you love like Jesus? 可唔可以有耶穌嘅愛咧 ？Could you encourage people like Jesus? 我可唔可以鼓鼓勵其他人好似耶穌咁樣咧？ Could you pray for their businesses to prosper? 你可唔可以好似耶穌咁樣為其他人嘅生意祈啊禱告祈禱咧 ？If you're a teacher, could you pray for your students? 如果你係一個教師，你可唔可以為咗你啲啊學生祈禱咧 ？You can do all these things. 你可以全部都做。To be like Jesus. 可以做呢啲嘢，像我哋。He has restored you. 係我哋復興咗我哋。We're in process of being restored. 我哋每一個都重新。And there's more to come. 然後啊，繼續會重新呢個過程會不斷嘅。I will bring again my people. 我會帶我啲子民過嚟。And they will heal. 佢哋會醫治。They will heal. 佢哋會醫治。Saith the Lord. 係啊，我所我神所。I will restore what the king. And the day that the locust destroyed, 我蝗蟲食咗啲嘢，我會俾翻你。I will bring again my people. 我會帶我會帶我嘅人民。And I will heal. 我會醫治。I will heal. 醫治。Say it. Today, Jesus wants to impart a special gift to you. 今日耶穌有個特別禮物係俾我哋嘅。He wants to impart heaven on you. 佢想天降降臨在呢度。He wants you 
to bring the kingdom to this world. He wants to change your lives. He wants you to prosper. He, want, he wants you to know joy. That old song, there's joy unspeakable and full of glory. Full of glory. Full of glory. There's joy unspeakable and full of glory. to be this morning like a bird. The Holy Spirit who rests on you fill you with joy that you can pass on to others. So stand up Stamp your foot. We're marching. Put your hands up in the air. We take Isaiah 61. We will restore the nations to glory. Jesus is Lord. 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 The glory. The glory. Glory. Now, if you want the presence of the Lord to take you on a new ride, change your life. Make it better. Bring many to the kingdom. Be happy every day. Put your hands out. Okay. We're going to pray. Philip's going to come and Richard's going to come and they're going to lay hands on your hands. And God's going to fill you guys up. Pastor Richard, come. Yeah, Richard, just lay your hands on their hands. Lay your hands on their hands. Father, we invite you to inhabit with you. Impart today your kingdom in this nation. Bring glory to these ladies and gentlemen. And let the fire and the glory of God impart on them now. Treat everybody the same. Treat 